In summer of 2020, I text Ralph on a Wednesday night and said, okay, we've been circulating ideas for too long. It's time we start our own brand. She responded, yes, I'm down, I'm in. One thing led to the next. We established our name as Daily Drills and the rest is history. Here's our story six months into business. and then try to stay off our phones at dinner while all the sales come through. So wish us luck. Do you think we could? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to, but I feel like if we stay off- But that's kind of fun too. Yeah, if we stay off all dinner and then we see how many sales we get in the first, I guess I'd be like- Maybe yeah. every time a drink comes out, we can check again. Yeah, we should. That's a good idea. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Guys, we just took the site live for a soft I launch. I can't believe it. Okay, we have 60 visitors. 60 oh, for what? Look at all those dots on the site. 71 visitors, 72, 72 visitors, 73. <laughs> it's just growing. There's three active, active carts. <laughs> I've never looked at the back end of Shopify like live like this. 88. This is better than the Super Bowl. 88 visitors, you guys. 12, 13, 14. We started with activewear and then we started to realize that our consumers really wanted loungewear, especially being in a global pandemic and saw our sales numbers take off from there. So right now, Daily Drills is a bit of everything. Everything from activewear to brunchwear yeah. to going outwear. Like really Just anything wear. Like. Yeah. Daily Drills, drop one. Trying to let the feeling settle in uh, Cause we larger than we ever been yeah. Long hours on my cell phone Hi. Love letters for text messages Say I stole your heart, yeah I bet I did yeah. And I don't care what the weather is Super size, I'll show you what different levels is yeah. Our first ever model <laughs> We made it! We made it! But we're also very different in the best way. So that's what makes us different. Yeah, talk to everyone about. I know. I feel like we always like talk about each other in front of each other, which is kind of cute. Yeah, that is cute of us. Ralph is definitely more laid back one. Would you say? I feel like I'm high, strong. No, yeah, but you can be laid back. Like honestly, we should go and tell them about it. But one thing about you is that when I think you're gonna be stressed out, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna tell him to do this. When we get bad news on vacation the day before our launch, 
guess who is the most positive about it? Kennedy Ro. or me? <laughs> For sure. Ro. No, you yeah. are. Uh, look, she just said Ro. <laughs> Kennedy, you just said it'll be fine and it'll be perfect. No, I said it has to be fine. <laughs> There's no room for it not to be fine. Like we have very wide points of view and taste. And taste, exactly. So even when we're like designing, but we aren't afraid to be like, okay, I like that, but X, Y, and Z. Or like, actually, I don't like that fit. Like, yeah, we're very honest and upfront with how we feel about something and, and like are always providing our why. But I think it's good because we can bounce ideas off of yeah. each other. And then once we're aligned, we're like, okay, we, we just came from like two different points of view and now we're merging them and settling on something that we it is much better than what I know. I know what you want. Exactly. If you're meeting a business partner, obviously you find yourself a Ralph. Honestly, find yourself a Ralph. You might want to be in an office. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> well, you have got to find someone like her, or else you'll still be making black leggings for the rest of your life. <laughs> so we fulfilled out of Ralph's apartment for the first four months of business. Mm -hmm. Carry like, big parcels up and down the stairs. To the third floor. I live on the third floor. It was even balcony outside. We're sweating. I mean, we're, I'm scared of elevators, so I didn't go in the elevator, but we'd sometimes shove boxes in there and like yeah. press it and then run out and then run to the top floor and then get all the boxes out. Yeah. It was fun, but at the end, oh my, my gosh, we were like, we've got to get out of here because we cannot continue to grow at the rate that we are. I mean, some days we would just have to leave everything in our living room until we could ship it out because yeah. we fully could yeah, thank God we sold out because all this, my living room was yeah. covered. Like I couldn't see Kennedy through the, through yeah. the wall of yeah. boxes. She'd be yelling, extra small, small, same. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the HQ. We're just organizing all of our inventory so we can get to shipping. Honestly, this is our workout for the day. Like Sexy. The pack. What else do they need to know? So this is some manual a, labor. You always need a pair of scissors, a tank top, a hair tie. Some deodorant, right Ralph? Some deodorant, <laughs> some, some clean beauty deodorant, and you need to schedule your manicure of the day after. Then we moved into a temporary office and we were just like subleasing from somebody using the upstairs of their um, office. Only one floor at this time, so they only have one flight of stairs. Yeah. Yeah. Which is nice. Yeah. But their lease was ending, so it was a perfect time for us to really reevaluate and think about the future of daily drills. Yeah. So we started touring off the spaces, one thing led to another. And here we are. <laughs> I would give them an office tour, but I feel like we'll want to do a separate YouTube video like before we have done. Yeah. <laughs> Should we dance on our chairs? video thank you thank you literally you cannot have done this without y'all we are so so incredibly thankful so blessed by all of our friends and family and everyone who watches supports buys follows anything yeah. so i think we have to say subscribe i think this is where we say like subscribe 